Tele, Kaivanisa, Suojele. Maybe you What's up guys, uh, we are here at the airport at uh, midnight, we've just received uh, guests and we have our host here from Finland, Mr. Bani. Yes sir. Thank you so much for your guests. Yeah sure. Ukwaje? Niko fiti. Niko you fresh. good, you good? I'm good man, I'm good, I'm good. You know I've been, been given this mandate to introduce because I'm the one who is uh, uh, good with English. So <laughs> that our, our guests will understand what we're talking about. Yeah, welcome so much to Kenya. How are you feeling? Um, amazing to be here right now. How are you feeling? Amazing, yes. Yeah. <laughs> Asante sana. Amazing, amazing, amazing. So, uh, Trudy, you have a question? Yes, yes. Uh, first of all, let's talk to Mr. Bani or Beni. Bani, mm -hmm. Bani. Tell us more about this trip. You've decided to bring Wazungu Hapa Tuna ni Wengi Sana. Yeah, tell us more about it. So, uh, I'm Bani Yasila. Yes. I'm originally from Kenya, Nakuru. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm an artist and I also run a music tour organization in Finland called Mziki Tours. Mm -hmm. So normally we arrange for tours for both singers and people who want to tour Kenya mm -hmm. to come and see our culture, see our country, get to see our, uh, enjoy our African cuisine, get to know the people here and to interact through different projects, music activities and different other projects. So we have these, my friends here, Tony is a great friend of mine from a place, a place called uh, La Peranta in Finland okay. and Katrina is uh, actually her colleague, yeah. they work together. So they are visiting here for about seven, eight days, I think about nine days, just to see how we do stuff here and get to enjoy our country. Yes. How long did it take you to plan all this? Because clearly we can see you prepared it so well. We make a revision of Zuri. Maybe tell us how you prepared it. It's been long because we started planning it, I think, uh, about two years ago. Four three, years, three, four, three, years. four years. Four years ago. Four years, yeah, before COVID. Okay. We planned, uh, we were supposed to initially come, I think, in 2020, 2021. Mm -hmm. And then we had to push it okay. to 2022 because of COVID. Mm -hmm. And then again after 2022 we pushed it. Mm -hmm. But now we're here, so we are happy that we're finally here. Mm -hmm. And they're here, I'm sure they're excited. Are you happy? Yeah. Really happy. Yeah. <laughs> How many are they? They are 13 in number. 13? Yeah. Yes, yes. And so many people may ask themselves, what inspired you maybe to come up with the idea mm -hmm. that you're doing right now? And maybe your achievement, what are you planning to achieve? So myself, as I said, I'm an artist, originally from Kenya here, of course, but I live in Finland. So uh, the fact that I live there and uh, I've been able to create platforms through my music uh, for other people here to also get opportunities to uh, empower themselves. So I'm also doing this kind of projects to create platforms for other people over here. And of course, when they come here, they also uh, get to see our culture, uh, promote tourism also. Tony here is a musician. So he's also here to see some music in Kenya, how we do our music. Okay. She's also a, a musician, you play. Yeah. yeah. Yes, she's also here to see, uh, she'd like to see some of our, how we do our music, uh, church music and different other stuff. But most importantly, uh, as you asked, uh, this is just one of the groups that we're bringing. Next year, next, next week we have different other people coming also. Okay. We have, uh, for instance, we have one big festival called International Night of Worship Festival mm -hmm. that is happening next, next week. Uh, we have about 45 singers coming mm -hmm. from different countries in Europe. And then uh, again in the month of July, we have about 200 singers again coming mm -hmm. from all across Europe. About nine countries from Finland, mm -hmm. Sweden, Spain, Switzerland, USA, Japan. So quite a huge group coming. Mm -hmm. So this is basically about creating opportunities also for them to come and see our culture, see our music, and also have our guys to interact with them and get to know more about. Okay, a question you. to our visitors. Maybe what are your expectations here in Kenya? You know, as we love visitors and we are happy to see you, what are your expectations? Uh, I like to see the church, of course, and I like to see how you live here, and um, animals, of course, and safaris. Yes. Mm -hmm. yeah. awesome. Awesome. Yes. Uh, uh, to see and to feel African music, <laughs> yes, of course, just like uh, you did. Yes, as uh, we did. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yes, and uh, well, uh, I think the um, nature here is marvelous. So, actually, I, I waited all my life to see 
uh, uh, Africa yeah. in general, yeah, yeah actually, wow. Wow. and so nature and so on, so it's a, well. So this is a great opportunity for him because he says he has waited for all his life to yeah. be in Africa. <laughs> <laughs> But now he's here. Yeah, yeah. Um, actually, uh, uh, can, can I say something in Swahili? I, yeah. Because I've, I've learned. Yeah, of course. <laughs> of course. Mimi ni Tony. Ina pura hakukuta na na bebe. Sema sema mambo ina chemuka. Mambo ina chemuka. Mambo ina chemuka. Kabisa. Yo, maybe it, uh, when we finalize, Bunny, you have a new song that you just released like uh, yeah, 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 yesterday. Yeah, 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 yeah. And uh, you are a gospel artist doing very well in Finland. Mm -hmm. uh, what do you think is uh, something different that maybe is finishing uh, gospel music in, in Kenya? <laughs> and we have DJ Gigi here, one of the best uh, active my guy, gospel my guy. DJs right now. Uh -huh. Yeah, Maybe we'll also say something on that. But uh, on, from your side, mm -hmm. why do you think uh, like uh, every day, every day, gospel artists in Kenya wanapungua? I think that is that is really personal. It's diff it's difficult to say because uh, I can't speak about anybody. I can only speak about myself. So for me, I'm passionate about gospel music. I know why I do gospel music. I'm passionate about uh, being Christian and doing really uh, uh, the music that I do because I know where God has really brought me from. And talk of that, I've sung to Tony's church for many times. He has invited me there to sing many, uh, many times. Last year we had an African concert, do you yeah. remember? Yeah. How was it? It was great. Did you dance enough? <laughs> yes, whole church danced. Yes. <laughs> we had an African concert in his church. He's one of my great supporters in, in Finland. Uh, and of course I do other tours also, not just in Finland, in uh, Sweden, in Spain. Before I came here, I was in Barcelona, Spain for a tour. I was in Switzerland also. So um, if you ask me about Kenyan, Kenyan artists, why they do their different stuff, I think that's quite personal. For me, I'm focusing on what I do, and I'm happy that I have great team here. will say that, because he's the one who Gigi plays the music. Mambo. Maybe uh, how did you manage to gather 15, uh, should I say, Finnish, ni Finnish, you are yes. Finnish, yeah? yeah. You are finished, okay. Someone from Finland is finished. You are to mess up my son. So they are finished. <laughs> yeah, so uh, how did you manage to bring like uh, together all these finished people to, to Kenya? And uh, do you have like some support from somewhere maybe? Yeah? Not really. Uh, I told you I also run a, a tour organization, music okay. tour organization in Finland. Okay. Uh, it's called Mziki Tours. So we worked with Tony and Katrina. Tony here and Katrina did a great job in helping us to uh, get people who are willing to come along. So this is not the only tour that I'm doing. We have many others coming, as I mentioned, and Tony also knows, by the way. We have this coming uh, festival. It's a very huge festival I told you about. Yeah. So um, the festival is gathering about uh, 45 to 50 singers from aclo across the globe, about six countries. And then we have another one, International Ziki Gospel Festival, mm. gathering about 200 singers. That's not Yosikazi Raisi, man. So, Nikazi ya Mungu tu. Nashukuru Mungu, Mazeni God. Thank you. You said Tony here is a musician. Maybe Tony, yes. you can give us some a cappella. A Finnish song. Just a moment. Finnish hymn. Yeah, Finnish. Uh, really, Rashinola. Finnish hymn. He goes uh, well, it and uh, sing, uh, uh, sung by traditional style. So it goes like this. Ystävä sä lapsien, katso minun pienen, minne käynkin maailmassa, sinä olet hoitamassa. Onni täällä vaihtelee, Kaivan isä suojelee. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Maybe you can only watch your new year. 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 I think I'm gonna. <laughs> so, so he's safari uh, he's yes. safari ndo tunaanza yeah. next week wengine wanashuka yeah. after that kuna wengine wanashuka mm -hmm. lakini nashukuru sana kwa kutujoin hapa welcoming these uh, our guests thank you for joining us so we so are the hoping the total number is uh, about how many people you expect today no, no total in total about 350 wow about 350 in the next 3 weeks wow. so asanteni sana watu wangu 
tunaona tena si tunakuja na kuru ama vitu yeah. yes. tunakambia na kuru eh yes. Las Vegas yes. <laughs> alafu tunakutana na Masai Mara kule pia Kabisa. Mamba Sandi pia sio mm. asante so, sana Mara tu aone wanyama pia tuko na tumbili hapa pia eh mwenyewe ni mnyama so thanks so much guys